Hello everyone and welcome back to number one PCO training. All right, so this video here is probably the most important video you'll watch about the topographical uh, test, yeah? The route planning anyway. So this video will explain to you so many things, like just this area alone. I actually created uh, the full route um, about eight or nine months ago and I created this route um, for training purposes, right? Just so people understand, yeah? It's all over YouTube now. So yeah, a lot of people have used it or whatever, but this part, this particular part here is so important. So let's say, yeah, we want to get from here to here. So our green point is here and our red point is here. So our red point is on the A406. There's only one way to get to the A406. Now, I'm going to show you guys basically the fundamentals of this map, the things you can and can't do. This route is going to explain it, right? So when I'm here now, I'm going to go straight ahead and I cannot go in here to go to Hazelwood, right? It's impossible. Now, why is that? Because here is a two-way road, right? Look, one side is solid and the other side is solid, right? They're both the same. Both sides of the road are the same. This is a two-way road. That's the sign of a two-way road. If both sides of the road are thin, so this is thin and this is also thin, it's a sign of a two-way road again, right? So as long as both sides of the road are the same, it's a two-way road. Now, when one is thin and the other is solid, this right here is a sign of a one-way road. This is a one-way road without the arrow. This is how you can tell a one-way road without the arrow. If it's the arrow is there, obviously, it's really clear. But this is actually a one-way road without the arrow, right? So that road there, the reason I cannot go in there is because if the two sides of the road are different, then your left-hand side, so listen carefully, your left-hand side must be the solid side. Are you guys with me? Your left-hand side must be, it must be the solid side. So that road there does not belong to me. So when I go in here, this is a one-way road for me. Now, if you look closely, my left hand side is solid the other side is thin however my left hand side is solid so this here is actually a one-way road for me i'm going in the right direction there's no doubt so when i'm going in here now i'm going in here this is a one-way road and then it becomes a two-way road why both sides of the road are solid so when I'm here, what I cannot do is I can't go across the A406 and take a right here. That is impossible. Now, a lot of people would say we're going under or if I did this, I'll be going across. I'll be going underneath the A406. No, for you to be going underneath something. So if you're going underneath something there must be something on top of something. You must see two roads on top of each other. So for example, here, there's a road, the A406 is here, and this road here, Hazelwood, goes underneath it, right? So there's two roads on top of each other, very clear there. Whereas where we are, it's open. It's open, right? Where, where we are, it's open, so I can't go across here. I'll be crossing the central reservation barrier. Yeah, I'll be crossing it. So I can't do this. Impossible. If I'm there, I can only go left. And obviously going left is no good to me because I would be going all the way here and then coming back around. It's just a no-go, yeah? So what I'll do is I will turn in here. When I turn in here now, look at my left-hand side. It's solid. The other side is thin. However, my left-hand side is solid. This is a sign 
of a one-way road for me, right? So what I'll do now is I'll go around Hazelwood. This here is a pedestrian uh, bridge. Yeah, people used to cross, so this does not affect us. That is above us. It's on top of us. And then what we're doing here is we are actually under the A406. Yeah, so our road is here. We see a bit of it. Then the A406 flyover, it covers it. And then the other part of our road is here. So we can just go across. Our road doesn't just disappear. Yeah, this is where you just have to use your imagination, right? So what we've done now is we've gone under the A406. Again, we will go under this bridge. And then I cannot just take a right here. Yeah, I can't just go on the A406 here. Yeah, the slip road. Because there's a central reservation line there, right? You see that black line there? You can never cross it. So what we'll do here is we'll go around the roundabout. Yeah, go around it, around it. And then I will take a left on this slip road here. Now, why this one here? I know it's clear to see it's most likely going to be our road. But the reason is our left-hand side is solid. This is a one-way road for us, right? There's no doubt about it. Our left-hand side is solid. It's how they built this map. All right, so if I did this now, if I did this now, guess what? This here would be a straight fell. Now, why? Because my left-hand side is the thin side, yeah? The other side is solid. So my left-hand side is thin. I'm going in the wrong direction. That road does not belong to me at all, right? That belongs to anyone on the A406 that's coming from there and somebody that wants to head to where we were coming from, right? Because look, their left-hand side is solid. They're going in the right direction and they're heading to... Sorry, let me get that back. They're heading to the... They are heading to uh, where we came from, yeah? So Neesden Lane. And this here is actually their road because their left-hand side is solid. The other side is thin. However, they're going in the right direction because their left-hand side is solid. Yeah, I hope that's clear, guys, and it makes sense to you guys. Uh, the full video is actually... Um, was actually uploaded by me about eight or nine months ago so go and give that a watch and remember if it's a side of a one-way road your left hand side will be solid yeah if there's a, if it's a two-way road both sides of the road are solid okay so both sides are solid if it's a two-way also if it's a two-way both sides will be thin so as long as both sides are the same it's a two-way road. The only time you do have a problem is when one side is solid and the other is thin. Yeah, remember that, guys. When one side is solid and the other is thin, this is a sign of a one-way road. And how can you tell if you're going in the right direction? Make sure your left-hand side is the solid side. Yeah? Guys, I hope that was helpful. This is for training purposes. So this route here is for training purposes, but it will help you understand the map a lot better. Hopefully it's helped you understand the map more than you already do. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.